hello to my good youtubers out there welcome back to another toddy walnuts collection overview video today i'm going to share with you my blue underground collection which consists of 68 titles both on blu-ray and dvd and a couple box sets there at the end i'm going to go through one by one and show you guys what i have and i did alphabetize this time for those of you guys with ocd that didn't like the arrow collection overview so we started with numbers here and the first one is just franco's 99 women and this is the three disc limited edition including the notorious french version which has i believe um uncensored porn clips that are added to the film if i'm not mistaken i have not watched it yet the next one is an Enzo Castellari film. This is the 1990 The Bronx Warriors Blu-ray DVD Collector's Edition. The next one is long out of print and very hard to find. This is Bad Boy Bubby. And this is a foreign film. I believe this is a Dutch film. I could be wrong. But it's basically a film about um, incest and about a, a mother who locks up her grown son in a one or two bedroom apartment and she tells him that there's an apocalypse outside and he can't go outside without a breathing apparatus or he'll be killed by the toxins so she makes him stay indoors all day and then she does really weird things with him and it's beyond bizarre it's a really weird movie i don't recommend it the next one is a dario argento giallo film the bird with the crystal plumage and that's a good giallo slasher film i enjoy it the next one is a Christopher Lee twin billing of The Blood of Fu Manchu and The Castle of Fu Manchu. And both of those films are just Franco films. I have not popped that one in to check it out yet. Next one is the A Bullet for the General, which is a spaghetti western starring Gian Maria Vellante and Klaus Kinski as always the bad guy. Probably one of the best bad guys in the history of film. This is the two disc special edition. Another Argento film, The Cat O'Nine Tales, starring uh, Carl Malden. And it's a good 1971 film, I believe. The next one is another double feature Christopher Lee and Klaus Kinski in Circus of Fear and Five Golden Dragons. I have not watched that one yet either. And we have some classic Fulci, City of the Living Dead. Very good zombie film. And another spaghetti western, Compañeros, starring Franco Nero, Tomas Milian, and Jack Palance. A film by Sergio Corbucci. Very, very good film. All-star cast. A George A. Romero film, The Crazies. This is the original The Crazies. There has since been a remake. And I enjoy the original a little bit better. And this is a Dario Argento triple bill. And they each come on their own discs. This is the Cat O' Nine Tales, Deep Red, and Inferno. Um, if you're on a budget or just want more space on your shelves, this is the way to go. You get all three discs in one edition. You could also get them singly. The next one is one of the newer releases from Blue Underground, and this is the Blu-ray DVD Combo Pack Collector's Edition of Deathline, also known as Raw Meat, starring Donald Pleasance and Christopher Lee. And one of my favorite Giallo films from Dario Argento, and this is Deep Red, a.k.a. Profondo Rosso, film from 1975, very good. Okay, I had to take a brief intermission and wet my whistle. Got a little drink of water, and we'll get right back into it here with Django. The original Django, starring Franco Nero. The original and the best, in my opinion. Very good spaghetti western. And then we have an unofficial sequel called Django Kill, If You Live, Shoot, starring Tomas Milian. And 88 Films will be releasing a Blu-ray edition of that with a slip cover coming up very soon another Enzo Castellari film this is the blu-ray DVD combo of escape 
from the Bronx, part of the Bronx Trilogy. Very good. Another Jess Franco film, and this is Eugenie. Three disc limited edition. And here is a sci-fi film starring Kirk Douglas, Martin Sheen, and James Ferentino. That is the final countdown. And then the first and only animated Blu-ray, at least that I know of, that was put up by Blue Underground, and this is Fire and Ice, a Ralph Bakshi film. Very, very good. If you guys like your sword and sandal fantasy films, this is definitely one to get. And that slipcover is really nice. It has the same image on the cover that it does on the slipcover, but if it has like a foil effect to it, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to pick that up on the camera, but it's really nice. The next one here is Get Mean, starring Tony Anthony. Two disc limited edition, another spaghetti western. And here is a Larry Cohen film called God Told Me To. Rooftop sniper type film. A guy that has just been pushed over the edge. Here is a twin billing of Hell of the Living Dead and Rats. And I'm going to show you guys a mask at the end of this video. That's um, that image right there at the top. And another Fulci, another classic Fulci. This is The House by the Cemetery, one of his best. Another Dario Argento gem. This is Inferno. And another Franco perverted story called Justine. Three disc limited edition. These are really nice editions. And here is another triple pack. You can get them all three movies on each their own disc or you can get them singly. This is Baba Yaga, Night Train Murders, and Strip Nude for Your Killer. I still have to get those singly, but I plan on picking those up at some point. The next one is a really underrated zombie film. This is called The Living Dead at the Manchester Morgue. Or Let Sleeping Corpses Lie is the U.S. title starring Ray Lovelock. Really good film. I enjoy that one. Now here is one I haven't seen yet. This is the two disc limited edition of the original and uncensored version of Love Camp 7. Kind of a sexploitation, Nazi exploitation double feature. Or just a, not a double feature, but just one film, I guess. And let's see here. Where are we at? The Fulci collection. You get City of the Living Dead, The House by the Cemetery, and The New York Ripper three disc set from the maestro himself. And another Fulci. This is a three disc limited edition of Manhattan Baby. Really nice edition there. And we have Maniac. Starring Joe Spinell, the late great Joe Spinell. We have Maniac Cop 2. Blu-ray DVD combo pack with the slipcover. And Maniac Cop 3 Blu-ray DVD combo collector's edition, unrated version. Maniac Cop 3 Badge of Silence with the slipcover. Okay, the next title here is, um, some people categorize this as a spaghetti western, myself included. Others say it's not, it's more of a love story. But this is Man, Pride, and Ven Vengeance with Django Comes Death, starring the great Franco Nero and uh, has Klaus Kinski as a villain, and um, it's a good film. And the next one here is a creature feature ghost story called The Nesting. And this is the third and final in the Bronx Warriors trilogy. This is the Blu-ray DVD combo collector's edition of The New Barbarians, Enzo Castellari. One of my favorite Fulci films, The New York Ripper. Really enjoy that one. And a very cheesy zombie film with 
horrible special effects. This is Shockwaves with the slipcover. It's still a good movie, it's just very, very cheesy. Very low buck. The next one is called Stage Fright. And then I have Dario Argento's The Stendhal Syndrome, and they have since re-released it as a three-disc limited edition with the slipcover, starring his daughter Asia Argento. Really nice edition. And we have a slasher film called The Toolbox Murders. This is the original. They have, There has since been a re-release, a uh, remake of that film, which I thought was horrible. This is a slasher giallo film called Torso. This is really um, bloody. Very good film. It's a, it's a splatter film. Here is a somewhat of an anthology. It's uh, two stories from George A. Romero and Dario Argento called Two Evil Eyes. They each have a one hour segment in that film. And we have a fun 4th of July zombie film called Uncle Sam. I enjoy that film, it's pretty fun. And we have a snake creature feature film. This is the Blu-ray DVD combo pack of Venom. And the final Blu-ray is Fulci Zombie. This is the two disc ultimate edition with the slip cover. And I'm going to pause it for a second, take a break, and we're going to get into the remainder of the DVDs. Okay, the first DVD here is the X-rated edition of Bear Behind Bars, and it has segments of porn that was inserted into the movie. It's a woman in prison type film. The next one is called Cannibal Man, and it's, to be honest, it's not really that good of a film. I may never watch that one again. <laughs> um, just being honest. The next one is The Church. Now, this is a good film. This one is underrated. I don't hear too many people talk about that one. The diehard fans do talk about that one. And the next one here is a Fulci film. This is kind of a sword and sandal, sorcery uh, type film. This is called Conquest. I would like to see somebody put this out on Blu-ray. It may even be out on Blu-ray from Blue Underground. I'm not sure. I haven't looked into it. If anybody knows if this is on Blu-ray from Blue Underground, comment down below, please. The next one is called Dead and Buried. This is a limited edition, and I think this one is numbered. Um, see at the top right-hand corner, I have 04214. I'm not sure what it was limited to, but that's a really nice edition. It's like a digipack that pulls out, and it has kind of a foil cover. It's a nice edition. The thing about these, though, is they don't really last long on the shelves because they get dinged up, even no matter how well you try to take care of it it still gets dinged up every time you touch it so i do like digi packs but i prefer amory cases or something with a harder shell just a small gripe the next one is a zombie soldiers twofer with death dream and again uncle sam which i do have on blu-ray i showed you guys that already Next one is another Fulci film called Don't Torture a Duckling. That's an underrated Fulci film. I really enjoy that one. We have uh, another Spaghetti Western. This is Maurizio Merli as Menaja, a man called Blade. Here is Shockwaves again. Had that DVD for many years. And here is Two Evil Eyes, which I have since upgraded. That is, oops, that is the limited edition. I think this one might be numbered too. Let me stop these from falling over and then I'll check. Ah. Here, let's see. This one is numbered as well at the top. Uh, it says 17,107. I don't know what it was numbered, limited to. And the last standalone DVD is Fulci Zombie. This one is really nice, really good film. And then I have a Spaghetti Western four pack, Spaghetti Western collection with Menaja, Run Man Run, Django Kill, and Django. 
And then the Blind Dead Collection, which everybody seems to have, which has Tombs of the Blind Dead, Return of the Evil Dead, The Ghost Galleon, and Night of the Seagulls. You can see, and then it comes with a slim pack with uh, extras with the director, and it also comes with a book, a nice thick book. And there are the four editions. So that was my Blue Underground collection, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. Take care, and I will catch you in the next video. Thank you.